beautiful day to spread love and kindness. Tuesday, November 16th. Can you believe it? It is so beautiful out, but cold here. It's 39 degrees, which is chilly. So it is a little before nine and I am going to pool aerobics. Remember last week I went? I really liked it. So once a week isn't optimum, but I'm gonna try and it's a big kudos, kudos to me because it's cold <laughs> and I'm going swimming inside, right? So I figure if I can do this a couple times a week, do walks and do yoga, I'll stay in a good trajectory and uh, that's better than not moving at all. Actually, aerobics in the pool is pretty hard, so. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, all right. Thanks, Matthew McConaughey. Love him. You guys, what do you do for exercise? Do you exercise? And you know, a lot of things count as exercise that people don't realize, you know. I count exercise when I'm taking a walk with the dogs. Not the kind of walk where I wander around the yard and look at the trees. That's that's really too passive. But I'm talking about when we go like walking down the roads and stuff or at the park around the tracks and stuff, the trails. <clears throat> I used to many years ago be an aerobics instructor. I taught classes <laughs> like in my youth before I got married. I was a certified aerobics instructor. I taught step classes and low impact and fitness training and weight uh, strength training and all that kind of stuff so yes young julie was very very fit and very very thin and they say muscle has memory so i'm hoping that it remembers <laughs> We should use a tissue. The gross things mothers do. Cause can you feel the love tonight? What's the rest of the words? Kuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. Kuna Matata. No passing phase means no worries for the rest of our days. It's a problem free philosophy. Kuna Matata. Kuna Matata. Uh. Uh. Nice job. Nice singing. Can you feel the love tonight? He was a young warthog. When I was a young warthog. Uh, I like your singing. Did you have a bath? Do you feel good? You nice and clean? Mm. Did you have a happy day with Anna? Mm. Yeah, you did a lot of music today. Mm. You played a lot of music on your piano, right? Mm. Do you want your blankets? 
Okay. Let's get your babies. Hold on. There you go. I gotta go get your meds, okay? You want me to put the TV back on? Looking at the TV. That's the other Lion King. We were just watching the first one. They're very ch chatty tonight. Hello. So today was a pretty good Wednesday. Not a lot happened. Typical stuff. I had therapy around 12. Uh, what else happened, Daniel? Just kind of hung around. I tried to work on stuff. I was very fragmented today. I was like, uh. Um, and Thomas, I was supposed to go see him play tomorrow. He had a concert. I was really like, yes, he got tickets and I was going to go up. But his college just closed everything, canceled everything and shut down because COVID is really bad. I guess they had like a huge outbreak and uh, they had to cancel the performances. Tell us how you feel, Daniel. So, I'm not sure quite what I'm doing yet. I still may be going up there because he needs my help with some repairs. The frame of his bed that he got from Ikea, one of the pieces broke, so I can get a replacement for him. He's got class all day from 9 to 2, um, but his class is going to be all remote. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm going to see how, how we can do it. It's like over two hours to get there. But I was going to stay overnight, see the show, take him out to dinner. But I don't think I'm going to do that now. I think I'm just going to go up earlier, get him what he needs, or take him where he needs to go. And he was kind of bummed, so I thought I would do that. Come back, and then Dale has... An appointment at Yale on Friday, so this should all work out, I hope. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to go do his meds. We're all doing good. Everyone's good. John's been working 11 to 7 this week because he's auditing a plant in California. So, he's been on longer shifts. And that's kind of hard because we're so used to having sort of the same routine. But, that's okay. Come on, Henry. i got to do the meds. And fill up the feeding bag for tonight and tuck him in again. I just gave him a nice long shower. He has some some type of skin kind of rash on his back. I forget what the dermatologist called it. But he's got creams to put on it to help it. I did that. Oh. I think I'm ready to go to bed. I'm kind of tired. These short days are killing me. <laughs> Say good night. Say good night to the camera. Say good night. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. <laughs> He looks so tired, okay. And then I gotta go do the seizure meds. And then I have to do mine and go out and my own stuff. Take the dogs out and go to bed. It's only eight o'clock. <laughs>